I'm Krista with the Monroe County Public Library, and today I'm going to show you how to assemble egg shakers. We have a take and make kit available now with all the supplies that you need to make them. Kits are available while supplies last at the main library, the Ellisville branch, and out at the bookmobile. Let's get started. If you don't have a kit, you can use materials that you might have at home. So what we'll need for this one are two spoons, a little plastic egg, some dried beans or rice, or I have popcorn right here, and some tape. Right, step one is you fill your plastic egg with your dried popcorns or beans or rice. However much you want. You want to leave enough space so that they can move around in there. This is a great fine motor skill practice for little hands as well. Putting the bead inside. All right, make sure it closes firmly. Step two is you take your two spoons and you make them face each other. Just like that, so that there's the opening right there. And then we're going to tape with some of our tape the handles so that we can put our egg inside. So I'm going to hold it together with one hand, and with my other hand, I'm going to twist the tape around. You can also color on your tape if you want to make them more colorful. I just have clear white tape here. All right. Step three is we're going to place the egg inside this little opening we have here for our handles. Let's see. See how it kind of fits? And it's pretty secure, but the next thing we're going to do is to tape it some more so that we can shake it and it won't fly out of there. So I'm going to bake my first piece of tape around the little crease where the egg is put together so that it stays together when I shake my egg shakers. And then a little extra support so that we can make a lot of music. And once again, you can decorate this if that's what you want to do. And then you're all done. And you're ready to make some music. Shakers and musical instruments are a great way to work on syllables, those smaller sounds within words. Try shaking out the syllables of your name, like Krista, even Beth. Medium. Damn. Singing and rhyming introduces children to word families and sound patterns that help build early literacy skills. Here's a rhyme you can try your shakers with. One, two, shake it on the two. Three, four, shake it on the floor. Five, six, stir and mix. Seven, eight, stand them up straight. Nine, ten, wave goodbye, we're at the end. You can also try using your shakers with some of your favorite songs. Here's a song that we can use our shakers with that teaches us about opposites. Ha! That one. Two shakers. Shake your shakers in the air. Shake them here, shake them there. Shake your shakers in the air. Shake your shakers. Shake them high and shake them low. Shake them yes. Shake them low. Shake them high and shake them low. Shake your shakers. Shake them near and shake them far. Drive your shaker like a car. Shake 
Take a mirror and shake them so Shake your shakers Shake them fast and shake them so Make shake them stop Shake them so Shake them fast and shake them so Shake your shakers Well done! And if you're looking for more fun ways to use your shakers, try joining one of our online programs, such as Tiny Tattoo or Zoom into Storytime. Thank you for joining me today.